Beautiful day across Acadiana today. Temperatures on the chilly side, but hey, we had lots of sunshine. More of that tomorrow and temperatures tomorrow should be some 8 to 10 degrees milder than today. Great weather for getting outdoors, doing some grilling perhaps before that big Saints game tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening. So here's the big picture across the lower 48. Elsewhere, it's still winter. Midwest seeing snow showers up through the northeast and the Great Lakes. Back to the west, actually relatively quiet pattern which bodes well for us. It's going to be quiet. We do have some clouds showing up across Oklahoma and into Texas. Maybe a little Virgo, some light precip with this. This is an upper level trough that's going to be swinging on through here by tomorrow morning. Just some clouds here and we're going to take one high pressure ridge that's kind of centered off the mid Texas coast and replace it with another ridge of high pressure as we move into your Sunday. So here come those high clouds. So some clouds in the morning and this may help keep our temperatures not only above freezing but may prevent some frost from developing, but I'd cover the plants tonight and cover them again tomorrow night as we'll be down into the mid 30s and for flirting with the frost zone. So keep that in mind. Mid 30s tomorrow morning, lots of sunshine tomorrow afternoon. Latest graph model like 65 degrees with mostly a westerly wind. I don't know if we'll get that mild, but certainly that's going to be some 10 degrees milder than today. So get out and enjoy it going into tomorrow night. High pressure overhead back down into the mid to upper 30s and then Monday as we get into ML K day milder yet temperatures mid to perhaps upper 60s and then as we move along we'll see a persistent southerly flow so 40s as we go into Tuesday morning and Tuesday afternoon we might even push into the lower 70s and we take a look at that European model and put things in motion with some of the bigger weather features and here we are near 70 for Tuesday afternoon going into Wednesday even milder even though clouds piling up we'll have a frontal boundary that's getting close to us but it's going to take a while before it gets to push on through. Notice best rain chances should stay north of us as we go into Thursday. Temperatures lower 70s. I have about a 30% chance of a few showers Thursday. Better rain chances Friday as it looks like a front works its way on through. Briefly cooler as we go into next Saturday. And then Sunday we'll probably see a warm up again ahead of our next weather system that should deliver a chance of rain and storms late Sunday, perhaps into Monday. Cold air lurking up across the northern plains, but we don't see a real efficient delivery here. That's going to really get any colder than what we've seen so far this winter. Now tonight, low to mid 30s, a frost of a very good bet along and north of the Highway 190 corridor. We'll go mid 30s I-10 corridor and mid to upper 30s along the coastal parishes. And then tomorrow after that frosty, potentially frosty start, we'll warm up nicely. And notice the model gets us into the low to mid 60s tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow night, back down into the mid 30s, cold enough for some frost again with very light winds expected. And then as we head into your Monday afternoon. Temperatures getting into the mid 60s, so some nice days ahead and not as cold as we mentioned going into Monday night. We'll hold in the 40s. So a chilly night ahead, some clouds by morning, some frost possible as well. 35 the low tomorrow. Beautiful day. Great grilling weather for outdoors. Go Saints. Uh, maybe you want to grill some Brady burgers or Buccaneers burgers. So uh, we'll eat some meat and for you vegans could always be a vegan burger as well. Love that stuff as well. Temperature wise, we get into the mid 60s again Monday going into Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday highs in the lower 70s. Overnight lows getting into the 50s. Rain chances perking up toward the end of the week and then uh, perhaps again on Sunday. But this part of the forecast seven days out. Abby has been quite iffy of late, but in the near term, Lots of sunshine in our forecast. I think you're going to like that.